Hello world, Wavetime here bringing to you another episode of Minecraft Invasion. So, what I want to do is I want to finish automating this so that I can get everything working and we can send all of the stuff that, well, all the hard work that we're trying to get out of this to somewhere that will be, well, kind of helpful. So, I wanted this originally to be my energy wing, but what I think I'll do is temporarily I'll have a bit of a storage center here. What I mean by that is all the things that I'm going to be mass producing on this level are going to be sent to one particular area, so which that they can be awesome, etc, etc. So for that end, let us get this stuff going. So we have a few outputs here and if I am looking right green is to sorting but the output for this is blue output for this is blue but the output for this is green I think we're gonna want to yeah probably want to have this output to green as well or blue did I say blue yeah I said blue always active that'll be fine and this will also need to be extract Blue. Blue, I said. <laughs> okay, and we're also going to want round robin, because eventually when that occurs, we'll want that. But first of all, let's see what our stuff is that we are going to receive. Obviously, we are going to need to temporarily get rid of this system. Oh, God. Wait, 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 wait. Did you just delete my stuff? Or did I just break it? No, that I think that deleted it somehow. That is so freaking weird that that occurred and I don't have my item conduits etc anyway so I might as well get those on my bar. Let me actually get situated before I make a fool out of myself. Yeah, Tripping upwards way, tripping upwards. Oh way is a wonderful day. Yay! Okay, let us get ourselves situated again. So we have our conduits back in order, and we want this to be an insert, and it needs to be blue channel, and we have gravel going to here, so that is good. We want something going here, and I think what we'll make for that is sand, and we'll also have uh, flint for the other one. So might as well preset these up so that we don't have failure upon us. So, insert blue, insert blue, that's good. So we're going to get the excess gravel and the excess sand. Now, I don't know if we're able to insert gravel into here automated automatically. That I'm not entirely sure. We might be able to put it on the brown channel. Insert channel, brown it might accept it, it might not, I'm not entirely sure. Wait, these are the furnaces anyways. Uh, no, these are the furnaces. So we'll find that out in a second. We also have glass as well as smooth stone which are going to be exports from this entire system. So let us see if we have any other spare chests. No, we have colossal chest blocks. Uh, no, not exactly what I want. Anyways, where is my wood? Did I use all my... Oh, God. Hi. Um, how's it going? Okay. I know what I'm going to work on right after I finish this system up. Uh, and that is more turrets. Hmm. I got to think about this. Because it seems that these guys are spawning all over the place now. So let's look at our F7 map. We obviously have some light places for these guys. Um, that might be it. That might be it. These guys are spawning in random places and I'm thinking it's because uh, my builders are currently building. Which means that it could be a bit problematic. So I'm going to cancel the build here, actually, while I am going about things. And I'd like to light this place up, however, they are digging while I am waiting. So I, hmm, 
eventually I am gonna need turrets all over this place anyway, so let's just... They're gonna eventually break this again, aren't they? Let's actually look at our builder inventory. Seems to have ten torches. That might be where that all that is coming from. Anyway, so let's just do that. Let's do that. Then again, I could help her dig up all this place by just, you know, digging it up for her. And that is too kind of me. I'm just gonna not be that kind and just rewind or something along those lines. Ow. But what I am going to do, or need to do, is get all those turrets situated, which is going to necessitate me to actually finish automating this thing. What I was going to do is grab the wood from here, since I am going to need that. Oh god, you are using all that. And oh god about that. Uh, power is still somehow being an issue for me. Sanity has always... I don't know if it's an issue at this point anyway. Has sanity become an issue, or is it that I've accepted my lack of it and I have moved on with my life just waiting for the inevitable to happen? Something along those lines. I think I think that's probably the closest to the truth that I'm actually going to be able to get with right now. But let, anyways, let us move onwards with our crafting expedition to be expedient at our express uh, disappointment. Yes. Okay, get a bit more of this. And I think also another thing that I will be... Well, I will want to actually make a saw blade. I think I'll make this up here. Also, unless I have room. If I were to put it there, that might be good. Then again, this is, I guess, is my processing floor. So I might as well do it there. Anyways, I'm not going to need the sand anytime soon. So what I think I'll do is grab the stone. And we will add all of the necessary gadgets for that. So automatic insert blue. This should be automatic extract. We have 18 stone in there. No, we have to have more than that. There we go. Uh, apparently, I was just insane. Okay, let's just get a stack of this because I am going to need to stack that up at a later point in time. And we can move onwards, I think, with our turret stuff. Turret stuff seems to be a bit more important right now. But I only have five redstone, so let us just improve this turret assembly. Um, how much do you need? You need to have access to that, so that... <coughs> Mm -mm -mm. Man, shifting really is starting to become very interesting. It's an interesting dynamic that I am experiencing at this point in time. So let's dig you out. And is it shifting that is causing me to automatically place all this stuff? I think it might be shifting. Yeah, that's probably it. Huh. Okay, so let's pick these up first and get these items down. Actually, put this down first. We need the cobblestone network. I'm looking back at my notes. Brown is cobblestone. So insert brown. That is good. And we'll have you going back over here. And while I'm doing that, I'll need to put the power down as well. Eventually, I am going to need to add power to a bunch of the other stuff. And I am going to need more of those conduits. Did I have all the extra stuff here? Yes, I did. Okay, so that is good. That is good. Gotta... You know, it'd be good if I actually checked before I was recording if I was actually, you know, muted the entire time. Because one of these days, that is going to happen. I'm just going to mute myself one time and not realize I didn't unmute myself. So, disposable turret. I'm going to want... Quite a few of these. How many can I afford? I need one, two redstone per turret. I only have five redstone currently. Probably make that six after I get this. Yep, six. So let us make three turrets. One there, two for there. Uh, pick that up because I am going to need to put that there. Thought I had one more. I Yes, I do. Okay, that's good. Uh, two turrets coming right up. I need a bit more wood, which will be helpful. One, two, three, four. Boop, 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 boop. Boop, 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 boop. I need to get, like, some big store of this or something. You know, be a bit smarter with that, but whatever. It's not like it matters right now. So, one, two, three. Three turrets, yes. Okay, I almost made four. 
I made a fourth of those, though. So that's always handy. At least I'm going to have a spare for later on. Now, what is it? Normally, I guess normally that is the way that I'm going to have things attacking me, so I might as well... Eh, whatever. That is going to have to do, and I'll set this to the max detection rate. Eh, let's put it at 5. It's not like it's going to matter. Mm, this side is the seaside, so I think having max detection range for that, so that it can get anybody there, would be a good idea. I'm going to also have to figure out the wireless redstone stuff, but anywho. Uh, so what I think I'll do right now is, I already disabled the building of that thing, so let's cancel the build of that and that that here and just have the builders build this thing over there hopefully they'll be able to do it safely I might need to actually get a better shovel for her actually I think I might as well wait for her to level up before that becomes a thing okay so I've got a lot of stuff here as well this stuff needs to be in the trash this stuff I need to collect and process this stuff I need to process as well I guess this mm, this, I think, is going to be have to be a project for another time, but what I'll be able to do right now, at least, is process this so that I have a bit more clay on my person, which will be helpful since I am going to need to actually start mass producing all of these things, which is actually one of the reasons why I am making all of this sand and gravel. Oh, God. There we go. Uh, we're going to have to lock that eventually. I don't think I uh, did the quest for unlocking that thing. Probably not. I'm going to venture a guess that I didn't. But it's always hard to tell. There we go. So now that I have all that, I will throw that in there. Throw that in there. And I guess throw that in there. And we can probably put the remainder of this stuff here, here, and there. Okay, let's actually, now that we have that handled, flower pots back here, eventually we are going to have all the stuff for renewable, uh, well, the things that I just created, but we are going to need to, okay, actually, now that I think, no, we don't have a use for these. Uh, sag mill these for plant clippings and trimmings. I can use these for cactus green, which I don't think is going to be much of a use, but I can compost all those. I can terraform those. This is from Extra Utilities, okay. Anvil for flippers. Flippers, okay. And a bunch of other stuff. But let's not focus on the other stuff right now because I think it'd probably be a good idea for me to get that sawmill operational. Just going to require me to put these things together and I am going to have all that stuff as well. So let us get straight into that. So we're going to need input hatches and output hatches. So input hatch requires machine structure. That's four iron rods and four iron plates. How much of each of those do we have? I don't think either of those that we have. Okay, we actually have those. So that's going to be helpful. So four of these. Let's make eight of them, I think. Might as well make eight of them. Okay, you're actually starting the builder. That is good. And I think we actually should start with this instead. Might as well because this is going to be quicker once that is plated. Well, not plated, but I think you get the gist. We can do that and that. Now let's actually see you working. Okay, you are digging from a far, far away place. I think you're actually doing stuff. Let's see. Are you breaking? Yes, you are. Okay. I could probably help her. Later on, I'm going gonna, gonna to help her. Maybe off camera, after this episode. Once I got all my other stuff situated, I'll help her with all the stuff that she's doing. Then again, all the holes that she is going to build underneath the place is probably going to be very, very... <sighs> It's going to be a long time. Anyway, so let's actually work on what I was trying to do here. So iron rods, iron plates, that is what we needed. That is good. And we are going to make this hatch. So make that. Good. 
and we're going to need an input hatch. And I think we needed an output hatch. Output hatch, yes. I did output. Okay. Output hatch here. Easy enough recipe. Probably should have done those uh, in another thing. Power input plug. So power input plug is going to require the small batteries, which requires a total of four plates and an iron rod, which is an easy enough affair to do. And we can throw this here. There we go. Uh, what else are we going to need for the saw blade? Uh, ooh, we needed redstone for this also. So let us get the redstone. We are going to need some of the bone meal so that we can uh, just do this a bit quickly. Quicker. Quicker. How much did we need? I don't know how much we needed. Anyways, I think two is a good place to start. Okay, yep, two. That is good. Let us make the batteries. I was afraid that it was going to crash. Wait, iron plates? Tin plates! Okay, not iron plates. Ugh. For a second, I thought it'd be easy. Ugh. Boy, was I wrong. Uh, you're set to rod, so let's actually make sure that you aren't rotting it up, because that would be very rodful. Now, some po sometimes... I gotta ask myself, are you even trying to make sense? Then I think, hmm, good question, Way. I don't know. And then I just shrug and go, YOLO swag, and just run out of ideas of what the heck I'm doing. Moving onwards, what was I doing? Yes, there he goes. As if to demonstrate the point, here is an exhibit of Way not knowing what he's doing. Which is always a fun time. Okay, I know that I can't do in my 2x2 two two crafting grid, and we also need a saw blade assembly. I saw that coming, and that's going to be 4 copper, and thank goodness we had the extra iron rod, because we are going to need that. So that, we're also going to need the power supply, so I gotta remember that is going to be coming up. And we need that. How many copper plates do we have in here? We actually have all the copper plates that we need, and how many bronze rods did we need? No, we needed copper plate. Uh, copper rod, rather. So, put that there. Put that there. And put this here. Yoink. Hmm. That'd be an interesting thought. Should I have a bunch of dedicated machines? with all the plates already. Need a shovel, a maximum grade of wood. Okay, so let's actually get her three shovels. Might as well. I mean, expedite the process a bit for her, so she doesn't go like, oh no, what am I gonna do? Okay, here you go. You got a lot of junk, which I am kind of surprised. Ah, uh, she had a heart. She had a heart. And I just consumed her art, which is kind of... Where'd all the oak fences go? Did you already place the oak fences? I know I filled you with all the oak fences that you needed. Ugh, I'm, I'm not going to even question this right now. It's just beyond my pay grade or something like that. Okay, so let's move onwards. We need the saw blade assembly. That is the four of those, all of that. I think I have everything that I need. We are missing. Needed two copper rods. Good job. Okay, and that is that quest, and we get the cutting machine and the hollow projector. And we already made this, uh, which begs the question of whether it is full of lava or not, or whether I am going to care with that. Probably not going to care about that right now, so let us move onwards. So, where are we going to have the thing here? We could put it here. I mean, it'll be nice and tight, but... Whatever. So, cutting machine here. Place. We're not going to want that there. So we have the input hatch, cutting machine, output hatch. This is the power supply. So let us place it here instead. Introducing here instead. Where you have no idea what you're doing here. Instead. 
Gun machine, we're still gonna need the saw blade. Output hatch, input hatch, which means what we'll end up doing is we'll have to route the input if we were to ever want to have this automated. I don't think we will want to have it automated, but whatever. Saw blade, I'll want to orient it so that it actually looks nice, even though it is going to eventually get formed, and we need a motor now. So, are we going to get a motor from any of these things? So, throw into the vat, I will eventually need to do that. Or rather, I'll need to do vat. Farmer John, don't trust you, and we get some of these things. Oct Double layer capacitor. We're okay, I just threw it in there. That is definitely what I wanted to do. Probably not, but a-okay, that is okay with me. And we also had one extra machine structure. Is this where we can put the motor? I could have sworn we had eventually a uh, craft um, something that gave a motor. Though I could be wrong on that regards. I'm not gonna. You know what? Let's just make a motor. Advanced motor. It's gonna require steel, steel rods, gold, gold coils. Four gold. Sorry, two gold coils. That's gonna require 16 gold, which is an easy enough investment. I can make that very easily. Let's put this away. I imagine I'm going to need to use that later. Well, at least she's digging away. And then we are going to need three plates, two rods of steel. We already have the plates. We just need the rods of steel. Uh, where are you, steel? Silver, aluminum, nickel. So, steel. That's electrical steel, not exactly what we needed. Dark steel, not what we needed. Oh, we had one steel rod. We actually needed two of those. Did I use up all the steel? No, of course I didn't. There we go. That would have been silly. Ugh. You know, I should eventually craft a bit more of this stuff. Then again, I don't have the iron in order to do that, but that is going to probably be my next step after I set up this machine. Because I actually do have an energy source that, well, is not just simple, uh, simply wind. Now the question is, does is this going to require more energy in order to do? So right click, there we go. Turn that on. It increases speed but doesn't increase the power consumption. So let us, we're going to do this amount. So that will make all of that stuff, and we're going to get all the wood that we are going to need. I don't think we're going to need to automate this. Let's leave this as an on-demand thing, and we can worry about any such things like that for the future. Not going to be something we need to think about for now. This is going well. That's going well. Okay, so all of that is going well. Let us grab this. We can just... What did this give us? A uh, singularity tank of nothing. That's actually good. We can use this for later. Uh, basically, this is just giving us a bit of stuff so that we can operate our tank, or rather our fluid thingamabob pump. Yes, that's a word, if we were to ever need to do that. Now, here comes the void resource miner. The Void Resource Miner, if we check this, is going to require Netherrack, Mossy Stone, and Endstone. Do we have any vines? No, we do not. I would have remembered collecting that sort of stuff, but we don't have any of those. I know where to get it. Is it over there? Do we have vines over there? No, we have vines up there, that's for sure, but I don't know if I want to actually go up there. Staff of Traveling. Let's look at the Staff of Traveling. Ender Crystal, gun requires stabilized Ender Pearl block of iron. We might as well make this. Blaze Powder. Uh, Blaze Powder. Where are you, Blaze Powder? I know I have Blaze Powder somewhere. Got Blaze Rod. That is actually equally good. We'll just throw that there, throw that there, don't need it. This will give us some blaze powder. Uh, we don't have all of the... Okay, equivalently, we are going to need... Let's see. Dark steel, easy enough. 
We don't have enough ender pearls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ender pearls. We're gonna need seven ender pearls, and we only have five. We're actually very close. I mean, once these guys mature, that'll be all that we need. And oh boy, is it dark! So I don't think I'll be able to get that thing now. Uh, let's get our nether rack and our other stuff. We're going to need netherrack, right? And we are going to need endstone. We can just pull up endstone if we were to need it. I don't think we have netherrack, but let's check what is the recipe for netherrack. It is lava and redstone. We got a bit of redstone. That's an easy enough thing to do. Mm, please? Thank you. Lava. Lava, lava, lava. Lava, do we have any extra lava? No, we don't. Okay, um, so I think it might be good opportunity to wait until morning, because I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything else in the interim, and then collect all the lava. I'm not going to be... Well, yeah, we'll collect that tank, swap it out. This is assuming that there actually is lava in the tank. If there's not, I don't think I'm going to want to go down in order to pick up the lava manually because that's a suicide mission and I'm not part of a squad for that. And no, I'm not going to pick up the lava there. That would be silly. And I am not going to submit to such japery, but I think we do have all the other stuff that we need in order to do that. So definitely next episode we will be able to do this. So let's actually look at some of the other stuff that we need to do. Power Reserves Mach 2. Capacitor Bank. Let's look at this. So the Capacitor Bank requires an empowered Redstonia which will require me to have redstone, that, 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 and it's going to require an empower. So an empower is something that I am going to need anyways. We already have a redstonia crystal. We need a display thing. This needs aesthetic green blocks, which requires chiseled quartz block. Chiseled quartz block is basically a bunch of quartz that I need to consume. I don't think our quartz supply is currently up to snuff either. So what I think I'm going to need to do is come tomorrow, I'll need to get the lava, I'll need to go and get the quartz because it's easy enough to process the quartz from the building over there even though I don't... Do I even have the bookmark anymore or were the... Yeah, the waypoints were all deleted. Hmm. Okay, so I'll go over there, get all the quartz that we need. Maybe I'll get some of the stuff there because having nether... No, I have enough nether bricks. Actually, I have quartz here. Let's actually do that now. How many did we need? We needed three. We also need iron casings and a thick. So that's a total of six quartz. Do we have all the quartz that we need for this? Five. No. We are off by one. Typical. Well, that's all the time we have for this episode of Minecraft Invasion. If you like what you see, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe to future episodes. They're all huddled over there, and I think I have too many right now. Then again, maybe more is better. Wave time here, signing off. Have a wonderful day.